Hello everyone, my name is Don Tate and I am the illustrator of The Amazing Age of John Roy Lynch and I am your favorite illustrator. Um, the first question is about the medium that I used. I used acrylic paints. These are acrylic paints. Um, actually, let me show you the whole box. These are all of my acrylic paints that I used to paint the book. I also used um, ink. Um, on watercolor paper and you can see that this point has a tiny tiny little point so I have to be very careful about every little detail that I put down and you know what I don't have a favorite medium sometimes I use oil sometimes I use acrylics sometimes I do computer art um, I kind of like to mix it up I would get so bored if I had to get up every day and paint with just one medium I also created what's called a dummy book. So I made this little book which I can hold in my hands and I have my little kind of my sketches of John Roy Lynch in there and this is the title page and I put my words, um, actually I put Chris Barton's words and my drawings in the book and now I can hold the book in my hands and I have some notes in here that my editor made. Um, maybe she didn't quite like this illustration very well so I had to change it. I have to do a lot of revision um, which means that sometimes I have to draw my pictures over and over again. So the next question is what is my art studio like? Well I'll give you a short tour. I have all kinds of books that I use as reference for all of the the books that I illustrate. This is the table that I used to create all of my drawings on. However, I do everything on the computer now, so I really don't use that table much. Again, I have a table full of reference books. It's just kind of where I display all of my some of my awards that I've won and my trophies. I used to be a bodybuilder, folks, so those are my bodybuilding trophies, and that's my son. The next question is, um, how did I go about researching the clothing for The Amazing Age of John Roy Lynch? Um, this is a book called What People Wore. And if you look closely, you'll see that it has illustrations that showed what people wore throughout time periods. I use lots of photographic books. I love um, just looking through all of these old old photographs so I could see what people wore and what the buildings looked like, how people would have wore their hair. Those are all clues that give away the time period. The next question, what are transport steamers like the one John Roy Lynch worked on? This is where the illustrator has to use um, some research and make an educated guess. Are there any replicas today? I have no idea. What advice would I give to young illustrators? You have to draw every day. Thank you for this opportunity to participate in the Texas Blue Bonnet program.